What's up everyone, Drew here. We're going to be showing you guys on how to jailbreak your iOS 5.1.1 devices using Absinthe 2.0. This is a untethered jailbreak. Untethered meaning you guys can actually go ahead and power off your device and turn it back on without a computer. That is excellent. So thanks to the Chronic Death Team for their hard work on this. I know they've been working hard and we've definitely been waiting for this. So this will work with the iPhone 4S as well as the new iPad 3. And this is excellent. Now before we go ahead and begin, I definitely recommend you guys actually do a fresh restore like I did. That way in case anything goes wrong, you know you have a backup of your stuff on your computer and whatnot. So right here is my iPhone 4S. So I do have Siri installed. And right there is Siri. And I do want to go ahead and go into settings. And then go into general, about, scroll down. Right there it is, version iOS 5.1.1. So let's go ahead and begin the jailbreak. So let's go ahead and actually plug our device into our computer. Just like that. And there we go. If iTunes or anything opens up, you just want to make sure you guys close out of those. So iTunes did open up. So we'll just get out of that. And now let's go ahead and run Absinthe. So all you simply have to do is just double click on the icon right there. Then here it is, it says, welcome to Absinthe, iOS 5.1.1, untethered jailbreak. Then here it says, please make a backup of your device. And this is a very simple jailbreak, guys. All you do is just have to plug your device in and click jailbreak, and you're pretty much good. And down here, it will actually detect what device you have. So we have an iPhone 4S running iOS 5.1.1, the latest version. So now let's go ahead and click on jailbreak and see what happens with iOS 5.1.1 jailbreak. In 3, 2, 1 jailbreak so we got some uh, text going across the screen here that's excellent and basically all you just gotta do is let your phone do its stuff and you don't even have to touch it just plug it in and you're done restoring in progress that's excellent I am just going to go ahead and let this do it full time. I'm not even going to mess with the editing and whatnot. That way so you guys can actually see how fast and easy this jailbreak is. It is super fast. And just like that, we should have Cydia on our iPhone 4S. Now, do not touch this yet. You want to make sure this bar is completely done before you actually slide to unlock because you don't want anything to go wrong with your device. So just make sure that bar is completely done before you unlock your device and unplug as well. And there we go. It says done and enjoy as you guys can see right there on the screen. So now let's go ahead and slide to unlock and simply check out our iOS 5.1.1 untethered jailbreak. Slide to unlock, simply scroll on over and right there is Cydia on iOS 5.1.1. So let's go ahead and open that up. Now it's going to go ahead and prepare the data and whatnot. And right now it's just asking me for my Wi-Fi. This will restart your device. Once done loading. You guys can go ahead and close out of Absinthe as well. We don't need that anymore. We just need this to actually restart our device. And there we go. Let's slide to unlock. Scroll over once again. Click on Cydia. Now it's going to ask us who are you. Click on user. Click done. Now it's going to go ahead and update data and whatnot. And there you guys go. That's how you jailbreak iOS 5.1.1 untethered thanks to Absinthe 2.0. And this should work with all devices, guys, including your iPad 3 and the iPhone 4S that does support iOS 5.1.1. And again, you should be good to go. Big thanks to the Chronic Death team and everybody that worked really hard on this jailbreak. Definitely make sure you guys head on over to their website and uh, definitely make sure you guys donate to them because they did do some hard work with this jailbreak. I will have all links down below in the video description for you guys. But other than that, thanks for watching guys. Until the next video, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Drop all of your comments down below. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter for more up-to-date news. All those links are down below in the video description. Until the next video guys, we'll see you guys in the next one.